Good day everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of the risk in the future trading. We're going to start with the signal automated trade. There is a five different automated trade on this one here. And uh, we had, um, this is based on only the last entry signal. We had an entry today at 46.85.25. This is, was the last entry. Target 46.63. Uh, you have the re-entry number if you want. You have the reversal. It did 86 ticks. And the NASDAQ 333 ticks based on the last entry only, not the whole day. Uh, the YM 130 ticks uh, based on the last entry, not the whole day. So if we don't have money to do all of it, we can trade only ES, NASDAQ, and Dow Jones. Those three are based on one contract. It has been a beautiful ride today, short all the way. And now on the CL, also we, we missed the target by one tick. And uh, now we start having some kind of reversal signal. Uh, this is a really amazing. Based on the last entry, 773 ticks into the profit. Based on the last entry signal. Uh, the Precision Auto Trade did very well. And there is hardly any lo very small losing trades today. Uh, we we show the same charts every day, whether you are a range trader or a minute, or you have high money, low money. So we we show you different uh, time frame, but it's the same charts every day. The CL12 range, uh, there is on all of them hardly any uh, uh, loser trades uh, today because the market was moving. Uh, the the ES 28 second, uh, the ES 3 minutes, uh, some of them they did go two rounds today. Uh, there is no loser trade on the ES 170 takes. Uh, the ES 3 minutes, no loser trades, you know, and most of them they were done by 11 o'clock. And uh, no loser trade on the, the, on the five minutes. Uh, 4,325, no losing trade. I mean, not every day it happened, but today because the market is uh, moving. So we hardly had any losing trades. Uh, on the uh, on the NASDAQ, three minutes, 1,000. Uh, look at the CL, it's amazing today. Uh, there is a, earlier today uh, a losing trade, but then Beautiful reverse V shape, break even, break even. The same thing here. There is a couple small loser trade uh, on the Nasdaq 300. Beautiful ride. Took a one trade here, 1,200, and uh, Nasdaq the scalping. Uh, ES three minutes again. The Nasdaq at uh, 590 take. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five. No loser trade. Straightforward. Unlike those kind of days when the market is moving, it's not the auto trade. Uh, don't get the wrong uh, idea. It is because the market was moving, and once the market move, you're uh, moving, and uh, and trending, and if you have a good auto trade. That will be your lucky day. This one here is ES 32nd. The same story also here on the CL. No loser trades on uh, CL 22nd. Uh, YM 2 minutes. Uh, NASDAQ 30, uh, 29 uh, second. 39 second, I'm sorry. And the NASDAQ 3 minutes scalping. So this is a really amazing. It is. It was a really a beautiful day. Uh, also, I want to mention on the TI7, uh, let me cover something. Uh, if you remember on the last week, uh, I talked about 30 range. So today I didn't use uh, the daily target on the NASDAQ. And uh, last week, you go to the previous uh, video uh, that this is not based on an ATR or stop loss. It is a base on the price. And then what we talked about, 
when the, the market is a chop, we have a very small loss in trades, and when the market is start trending, we grab every tick when the market is trending. So today I did not uh, uh, use the daily target. You can see here today, 5,040 and now 500 here. So you can see where's the chop, how it was a very small stop loss. It's affordable, so we are waiting till the market spike for today. And when the market start trending, we start grabbing it. And uh, this is the, the strategy I have explained last week. If you want to swing trade, how uh, the, the, the cost profit uh, on a losing trade has to be to the minimum. If you want to use some kind of a big time frame like this one here, because if you use a normal uh, uh, stop loss or normal trailing stop, uh, you are a dead meat in uh, this kind of time frame. You have to have an advanced auto trade can uh, not buy dummy auto tra uh, trailing stop and stop loss. It has to be much more advanced than that can monitor the market trend and that is a total different ball game when you want to try to grab the big fish. Uh, on the CL9 range as uh, you see uh, wonderful uh, today the market and the scalping NASDAQ also did 30 second here. Yes, yeah, 3 minutes 1500. NASDAQ 2 minutes. I did very well and the CL 3 minutes. Uh, the, the, the nicest move today we've had, it was on the DAX. I always use the four minutes, and uh, I like the four minutes on the DAX, and the DAX nailed 6,000 on one trade. It was easy, done, beautiful, one trade, done, 6,000. Scalp and ES, uh, five minutes, uh, CL, 55 second, ES, two minutes. You can see also it did very well. We had one bad trade, did very nice on the TI7. This is a total different auto trade. Uh, eight range ES did wonderful, uh, 2100, 1400 DAX we covered. Uh, the one minute, this is a statement on the one minute. You can see how lovely those trades, a little chop at the beginning, and then one and two, and did very well. And um, uh, this one here, the ES four minutes, and the 14 second. This was a lovely trade. By 10:16, we were done. We started 10 o'clock. No, sorry, we started at 9:30. 10 o'clock, 10:16, it was done. The 14 second, one, two, three, done. Beautiful. And uh, this is the luxury when you have. A stable entry you 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 start enjoying those time frame again here is your Nasdaq uh, for today uh, this is another chart uh, this is uh, uh, f uh, the five minutes and as you see it was uh, 6600 and then also did very well and then uh, we have uh, the YM20. This is 28 second YM. Look at this. Beautiful entry right before the market dropped. Nailed it all the way till the end. 3,100. I mean, this is 28 second. Beautiful. And the YM five minutes did very well. Uh, folks, that's all what we have for you today. Uh, that it was a problem today. We couldn't go live on the other channel, YouTube. I do have the internet somehow. I don't know if it was the problem from YouTube because we tested uh, the internet. We have no problem. But uh, the picture was not... Maybe because, uh, I don't know. I don't know, maybe YouTube was overloaded or... But it was some problem. We couldn't go live uh, today. <coughs> we will try to go live tomorrow. Hopefully everything will be okay. Thank you very much. God bless you all. And i see you uh, hopefully tomorrow live on the other channel. Bye for now.